This HAN Network video is brought to you by Carl Chevrolet. This is the HAN Network's 2016 FCAC Fall Tour. We are at St. Joseph's High School. I'm Frank Renito, and I am joined with the cheerleading captains, Kate O'Day and Claire Butler. Girls, thank you so much for taking time to come and meet with us. Let's start with the fall season. You guys are obviously in preparation for football games, some of the pep rallies. What's that experience like? Um, it's all about just like getting yourselves ready for what's to come and making sure we're working hard and have a lot of dedication so that when competition season comes, we're prepared. You guys will be at all the home football games throughout the fall. Is there one in particular, though, that stands out as one of your favorites? Definitely homecoming and Thanksgiving game. <laughs> Always a lot of fun. Obviously, though, the big season is in the winter when you guys get into competition. Mm -hmm. You were at Nationals not too long ago. You're the defending three-time state champions. What's your off-season process like now with your training regimen? Um, we've been doing a lot of CrossFit, and we have um, tumbling every weekend. So we're basically just preparing for the next season. And then when school starts, we get into like practices every week and just starting to work harder. You guys will obviously have some new faces on the squad this year. What's your role as a captain in, in getting them acclimated to the team? Making them feel comfortable is like the first thing. And then after that, it's just making sure everyone's working hard and getting everything we need to get done, done. Obviously, cheerleading is one of the close-knit groups in all of sports here in the FCAC. What is it that makes this team so close-knit and special? I think we have like a lot of different personalities, but in a way, like we all bond together, just like a different group of girls that like, we all, like, we're just always close in it. When you do get to that winter season, you get into competition, what are the meets that are really going to stand out you're most excited for? FCX is one we're hoping for, definitely. It's like, the past three years, it's been tough, but we think we got it this year. Um, and then states again for the fourth time, it would be. Well, girls, thank you so much for taking time out and coming to talk with us. We really look forward to seeing you on the sidelines in the fall, and we can't wait to see you in the gym in the winter. Make sure you stay tuned to the HAN Network for all of our 2016 FCAC Fall Tour right here.